Hurricane Diana was weaker at landfall than the preceding storms. The pressure was 978 millibars and the winds were only 41 meters per second. The eye was small and there was a large echo-free channel between the eye and the principal rain band. Wilmington, the radar site, is located north of Cape Fear in the center of the image. The sequence starts as Diana's eye makes landfall at Cape Fear. The hurricane's reflectivity is lower than the previous storms. The highest rainfall was associated with the outer band. This band intensified slightly as it moved over New River Inlet, 100 kilometers northeast of Wilmington. Diana was probably weakened by the ingestion of continental air as she moved slowly inland. Note the changes in the eye shape as Diana moves ashore. It seems the initial encounter with land perturbs the eye, but it regains its circular shape before it finally fills in over land. Weak bands do rotate cyclonically about the center, and they do seem more intense over the ocean. The At the end, most of the echo is stratiform. 